This is a first for Houston, but it joins the ranks of a few other states and other cities across the United States. Uh, we're talking about a mosque for all Muslims, regardless of sexual orientation, and it's set to open in just a few weeks. Fox 26's Tiffany Justice joining us live after talking with a woman behind the vision. Tiffany. Right, and Jonathan, this is a few years in the making. She says that the doors will be open in a week or two. She's just finishing up a few loose ends. This Pride Month is a great month for us LGBT plus Q people uh, to show our pride and our colors and who we truly are. Iram Rani, a Muslim LGBTQIA is, you know, activist in short is. order telling Fox 26 she will be opening the first affirming mosque in Houston, a dream she's been working on for a few years. I want to create a equality mosque with, you know, us queer people. That's one of the vision boards that I have is to create this mosque. She tells us from personal experience, she knows such place is needed. We've already had that much burden in our community. I'm just, I'm going to say that. And I don't want any more of that. I don't want, you know, any of the community, South Asian Arab community, whatever it is, I want them to embrace their children and I want them to embrace who they are. I have personally, you know, been judged very harshly when I go to the mosque, been looked at. For some queer Muslims, she said it's not always easy to balance their sexual identity with respect, religion, or even accept themselves as they are. For now, she will be using her storefront in West Houston. We feel like sometimes we go to our own mosque, we're not really welcomed. I want to be able to have them come and welcome and make sure they're welcome and safe. And I want to be able to have different little uh, platforms, you know, to do, you know, uh, a support group or more, but for right now I want to do a mosque. There are only a few mosques like this in the U.S., the largest and most well-known being in Chicago. Iram hopes to create a similar safe and inclusive space. I really, really want to show people that, you know, we can still be together and we can still love each other. Iram is still trying to gain some more funding. She says her goal is to have a standalone mosque sometime in the future. We'll have her contact information online. Reporting live, Tiffany Justice, Fox 26 News.